today's video is on equivalence formulas or loss of logic and this is related to the mathematical logics and this is from mfcs or dmgt so i'm going to explain you 10 formulas which are very very important and we need to find out whether the two propositions are equivalent or not using these formulas so these are most important and let me explain you one after the other the first one is item patent law as you know that in your previous classes i have taught you a square is equal to a so if there are two a's a will be the answer so here if there are two p's that is p or p or p and p so whatever it might be whether it is conjunction or disjunction the answer will be p here so this is about the idempotent law so in this way you can remember it's an idempotent law that is p or p is equal to p or p and p is equal to p and next one is an identity law so identification so if you see at a mirror so you will be exposed see here true and false you feel that this is a mirror so p and true is again p here and p or f it is again p here so this is identity law and next one is domination law so if you see true is dominated here and false is dominated here so p or true so opposite to this if there is conjunction here there will be disjunction if there is disjunction there will be conjunction here so the opposite signs p or true generally conjunction is related to t and disjunction is related to f whereas in this domination so reverse so here p or t is again t and p or f is again f so here the propositions won't come the true true or false will come so this is the domination law so this is how you have to remember for idempotent law a square is equal to a here p square is equal to p and p square is equal to p for disjunction or conjunction for identity law if you look at a mirror so you should be exposed so p and t or p or f which is equal to p here what is the domination domination law so reciprocal of this so p or t and p and f so true false will be projected here so what is a negation law so negation is very very easy p or negation p is true p and negation p is false so here for or it is false and and it is for or it is true and and it is false see here negation p or negation p which is equal to true and p and negation p is equal to false so this is how you have to remember and commutative law is also very simple if a into b is equal to b into a then we say that it is a commutative law in your earlier classes so here if p or q is equal to q or p or p and q is equal to q and p then this is a commutative law so comparing to associative law so we have to take three propositions a into b into c is equal to a into b into c remember that one so whether you take conjunction or disjunction so there are three propositions that is p or q or r is equal to p or q or r and next one p and q and r is equal to p and q and r so clear this one next one is distribution so distributive law so p is distributed to q as well as r so here p is distributed to q as well as r so here p or q and see here p or r so p is distributed to q and p is distributed to r so on seeing this one p is distributed to q that is p and q or this is p and r so distribution is like like that and de morgan's law so de morgan's law is also very simple negation of p and q if you send this negative sign or the negative statement inside this and becomes or see here negation p or negation q and after sending this negation inside this or will become and so this is so simple negation of p and q is equal to negation p or negation q and here also negation p and negation q so this is the de morgan's law and next one is absorption law so absorption law is nothing but if p is for two times write p here so here p is for two times so p or p and q is equal to p here p and 
P and Q. So here it is so simple that according to the absorption law, if there are two P's, write immediately P. So there are two P's, so this is P. So P is absorbed, absorption law. And next one is double negation law. So negation of negation P, minus of minus, which is equal to plus. So negation of negation P is equal to P. Hope you all guys understand these uh, formulas. And it is so simple, according to our idempotent law, a square is equal to a, here p square is equal to p, whether it is disjunction or conjunction, and identity law, identification means, so if you look at the mirror, so you will be seen, so p untrue, or p or false, which is equal to p here, what is domination, so here it is, true and false are quite dominating here, that is p or true, or p and f, which is equal to f, and next one is negation law, it is very clear that P or negation P is true and P and negation P is false. And next one is commutative law is very simple. A into B is equal to B into A or A plus B is equal to B plus A. So this on comparing with conjunction and disjunction, this is also very simple. Associative law is also very simple. A into B into C is equal to A into B into C. So when you transform this in terms of conjunction or disjunction, these two are also very simple. And distribution law. So here P is distributed to Q as well as R. So P or Q and P or R. And next one, De Morgan's law. So according to our De Morgan's law, if negative statement is sent inside, this this one is conjunction turns into disjunction that is negation P or negation Q or here if you send negation inside negation P and negation Q the, this is also very simple absorption law is also very simple see here P or P and Q is equal to see here P is absorbed absorbed for two times so write P here so here also there is P for two times write P here double negation minus of minus it is equal to plus negation of negation p is equal to p hope these are all very very simple if you follow these definitely you can solve any problem of uh, equivalence formulas using equivalence for formulas and in my next video i am going to solve so many problems related to these series and those are also very important i have taken from the previous question papers and those are going to be damn important for your examination and your preparation will be very easy if you follow the playlist and hope everybody likes this video if you like really like you know please subscribe do follow and share it with your friends and siblings thank you so much for watching and staying till the end